Wena mga higala, adto na kita sa Pulka Rock! Francisco Dagohoy led the longest revolt against the Spaniards in Philippine history. The revolt took the Spaniards 85 years, 744 to 1829 to 12. Forced labor was one of the causes of the revolt, but what triggered the decision to rise up in arms against the Spaniard, Spanish authorities in Bohol was the refusal of Joseph Chris to give a Christian burial to Dagohoy's brother. Morales ordered Sagarino Sandrias, a constable, to capture a man who abandoned his Christian religion. Sagarino, dakpin mo ang tao, nagabanda na ng pagiging Christiano, dalhin mo siya dito. Sige po, Father, kung yan ang gusto mo. Action! The brave constable pursued the fugitive, but the latter resisted and killed him. Ikaw, bakit mo ibinanda na ang pagiging Christiano mo? Inutusan ako ni Father Morales na dalhin kita sa kanya. Aarestuhin kita! Yan ka mga aresto mo ako. Tumba. Oh, oh kapatid na ikaw! Nagkahoy! 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 Ano? Kapatid ko! Kapatid ko! Tulungan niyo kung dalhin siya sa bayan. His corpse was brought to town. Okay. Father, father, petitionan niyo po ang aking kapatid. Hindi ko mamipetitionan ang iyong kapatid dahil namatay siya sa pagdidwelo at ito ay kasalanan sa simbahang katolika. Hindi maaay! Bumanda ka sa akin dahil sa iyong namatay ang aking kapatid. Morales refused to give the constable Christian burial because he had died in a duel and this was banned by the church. Also, Sagarino did not receive the last rites of the sacrament of extreme auction. Hence, giving him a Christian burial was contrary to religious practices at that time. What complicated the situation was the order of the priest to expose the rotting corpse for about three days in front of the Inabanga church, it is also possible, however, that since the priest refused to grant the request, the guru decided to place the corpse there to force the priest to change his mind. The strings of events led the guru to make a vow to correct the wrong done to his brother. In the process, he stopped paying tribute to the Spaniards and refused to render the required forced labor. He also called upon his relatives, friends, and the other residents to do the same and fight for their independence. Magigikanti ako sa pagkamatay ng aking kapatid. Mga kaibigan, samahan niyo ako patubahin ang mga Espanyol. Dapat na nag-ipaglaman ang ating karapatan. Maboy ang mga bola! No? Mabuhay! Mabuhay! Being so infuriated with the priest, he is instigated to the people to rise in arms. The signal of the uprising was the killing of Father Joseph Laberte. Italian is a curate of Hagna on January 24, 1744. Shortly afterwards, Morales was killed by the Goy. The rebellion rolled over the whole island like a tropical typhoon. Bishop Miguelino de Espeleta of Cebu, who exercised ecclesiastical authority over Bohol, tried to vainly to mollify the rebellious Boholanos. Daguhoy defeated the Spanish forces sent against him. Daguhoy died in 1800.
Spaniards tried to quell the rebellion but failed. On April 1828, the Spaniards sent their strongest expedition to Bohol, but they could not quell the Daguri Revolution in Bohol. After many years of defeat, Spain decided to put an end to the revolt Spanish and native, like Cebuano's troops. Olanos made their last stand in the mountain of Uasa under the command of the Valiant Brothers. Handog and Awag, in June 1829, they fought their last in battle where, and were crushed by Spain's superior arms by the survivors fled in the forest, where they grimly continued to carry on their hopeless cause. Their revolt ended formally on August 31, 1829. Manuel Sanz, commander of the Spanish forces, officially reported that 3,000 Boholanos escaped the other islands. 19,420 surrendered. 395 died in the battle. 98 were exiled and around 10,000 revolutionaries were resettled in the areas of Balilihan, Batuan, Bilar, Cabulao, and Katigbian. These figures all point to the fact that the revolt was this widespread in the province, being the insurrections in Tigator. The Guhoy continued to be a source of inspiration to his comrades even after his death. Bueno, mga higala, adto na sa pagkita sa Pulka Rock! Kapatid ni The Guhoy, Mark. Desi and Arwen. <laughs>